So this is so hard to be able to put everything into three minutes. So I just wanted to say that Harvest School has truly changed my life. Um, I didn't know what the Lord was doing when he called me there and why he called me there until after I like got home and I began to taste this freedom and this new love with him and um, I'm just forever undone <laughs> by what he did in my heart. I didn't realize how paralyzed I was by fear even though I tried so hard not to obey fear. Um, he truly delivered me from fear as I was there. Um, fear of man and also this denial of who God called me to be. Um, he truly, he truly ripped out those lies and um, just set my heart more on fire for him. And now I truly can say that oh, I was created for this and it's time to go. It's time to shine. It is time to be the light and to bring the fire. I had such a lack of confidence that I didn't really know that I did um, of stepping out and speaking what what the Father, the Holy Spirit is putting on my heart to say. And, um, and I just feel like God used Harvest School to push me out into that place with Him, to push me out and to say, go, my daughter, it is time, it is time to go. And I... I don't know if that makes sense, but it definitely hits me. It makes sense to me. But um, I, I've been praying about staffing. Um, I thought about it after school, as soon as school ended, and um, and I just wanted God's confirmation that what this was Him. And I, I've had multiple moments and encounters, and I had two significant encounters where. Um, I started fasting and I was praying and I got truly hit by the Lord in a way I've never been hit by the Lord um, um, back in this January. And as I was under the power of the Holy Spirit, he started to bring up Harvest School to me and he started to show me Israel. And then um, in that moment, I felt like he was, he was um, nudging me to apply to the school. And I still was like, are you sure, Lord? I don't know. <laughs> and then um, I just went to Asbury Revival. And we had a moment on the way back. It was so powerful where the Holy Spirit literally fell in our car. And every one of us were under the power of this, the Lord. And, and how it started was we were praying and worshiping. And then... The Lord just uttered in my heart, Jesus says, El Señor. And I started to declare that. And then immediately as I was saying it, the Lord dropped Brazil in my heart. And I just said, God saying Brazil. And it brought us all into this intercession and travail over the nations. And like, it was the most powerful thing I've ever experienced. And I say, all of that is I just feel like God is just connecting all the dots. I don't know all that God is saying, but I'm being obedient and, and applying um, what he's done in my life. Oh my gosh. I just, I want to see everybody walking in this freedom and, and empowering other people, encouraging other people, and being a part of what God is doing on the earth. There is no other joy. There is nothing greater. And um, it would be an honor and a privilege to, to staff with you guys. I honor you. I honor your leadership and how you lead by the Holy Spirit, how you are so dependent upon Him. And I'm, I'm just so hungry for God. And so I thank you, Jesus, that whatever... Whatever the Lord wants to do, I just say yes. So I love you guys. I bless you.